Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you guys your daily journal message for Monday, April 1st, 2024. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in your own private reading, all that information as well as the Amazon links to my books are down below in the description box below. So this is going to be a 15 card spread. Let's get right into it here. Yes, I am using a different deck today. Let's see, let's see. This used to be my favorite deck. Can't think of the name of it. <laughs> As always. Hmm. So somebody is spying on you, I feel, with that Three of Wands looking over at that Ace of Cups to see if you have started a new relationship elsewhere. Uh, I do feel that they have found something uh, through social media or through friends, kind of mutual friends here, of word of mouth here. Regardless, there was a big change and it really was kind of earth sh uh, shattering to find out that you moved on, okay? Now they find themselves in a very sticky situation not knowing where to go. Uh, they're a little pouty now of their own actions. They're reflecting here they, because of the slowness of their communication skills back to you here. I feel like you kind of like headed on forward in your life and rightfully so as well uh but yeah you worked on your energy and it's kind of like see see i told you if you didn't respond back to me somebody could have given some kind of time frame to get back to them or back to you i mean uh but regardless you took off you're done okay is what that says and you worked on your energy here and ended this cycle okay could be a lot of fire here, I do feel that. So you could be a fire sign here or dealing with a fire sign with that Queen of Wands energy. Not overly thrilled with their performance here of partaking in this. And I do feel that there's a lot of regret. They feel like a beep. <laughs> That's what I'm feeling here. Queen of Swords energy, you could be dealing with an air sign energy, uh, or you could be air here, but you do want this relationship, and if they do return, the possibilities are strong in regards to showing that action with that Ace of Wands energy. Now I have to point out there are two Aces in this spread, so it could be dealing with a Twin Flame energy, but regardless, it is a meant to be. Two of Cups, to me, is also known for a soulmate relationship here, okay? So I feel like they are going to be coming back out of jealousy, out of realizing uh, that they could lose you, okay, not feeling uh, your energy anymore because you kind of broke free of that energy and they're coming back to take that next step with the Four of Wands here and the Page of Pentacles right before that. So apology owed here in this situation, I feel, and there will be victory, but uh, things have to be you know, cleared out, okay, uh, explained here in this situation, this relationship first. So let's do the above and below here. You got the Ace of Pen, eh, hello, Ace of Cups, the, five, the Four of Cups, sorry, uh, and the Queen of Wands. So you got tired. You got tired of uh, waiting around, basically, okay, and you took charge, all right, that initiative here, because you don't feel, you don't, you know, logically feeling that, you know, if they're not showing that they don't love me or care about me, why am I here, you know, waiting, okay? Meanwhile, back on the ranch, I feel that your counterpart here, your love interest, is spying on you after a lot of regret that they could kick themselves for not coming back sooner. Uh, and I feel that there is definitely an apology here. They're hanging their head down low, literally. I know that uh, cards can't move. Uh, although, <laughs> I have seen that sometimes, and it does freak you out. Uh, but definitely, there's that regret with their head held low kind of energy here, feeling like an idiot, okay, that they didn't act, that they knew that they were going to miss out on you and this I literally heard this once upon a time beautiful relationship connection that you both had here with the three of wands, the page of, I'm sorry, the knight of swords and the page of wands present. With the tower, the ten of wands and the queen of swords, you know, it, it took a long time to take that encouragement to run, run, run away from this. But if they do come back, you're eager to kind of be wooed, all right, be wooed by them in this relationship here. 
with the Tower, the Ten of Wands, and the Queen of Swords speaking here. With the Death card, the Nine of Pentacles, and the Two of Cups, you grounded your energy. You had that change within yourself, and you're proud of yourself, and you should be. You know, it's tough to go through a cycle that is very painful, okay, uh, and in regards to this relationship. And you basically moved on from this relationship. The Temperance, the World, and the Ace of Wands. So this tells me is that after a long time here of waiting, you know, you said enough is enough already with the world. Major Arcana, meaning an ending here of the waiting with that world, looking over at that Nine of Pentacles. I'm going to work on myself, figure out my life here, and show that action with that Ace of Wands. So don't be surprised when you hear back from this person finally with some type of an apology, no 15-page essay, of course, but they want to take that next step, but they have to fight for your love is what that tells me. And that's what I have for whomever this is meant for, for Monday, April, this is no joke, 2024. Thanks, guys. Of course, I had to say that, right? Uh, but thanks, guys, for watching. Don't forget to subscribe as well. Smashing that like button, it definitely helps out my channel, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.